Well, I'm back to episode 19 of the Scott Steinart season mode here on Fog Wrestling. We are on Long Island, New York. And now, it is time for SummerSlam. Here we go. Are you looking forward to this show, man? I don't even think we'll be in a match. Been jobbed out recently of the IC title. Then, the tag titles. But we are here. Livening, living colour. In Long Island, New York, here for the biggest, the biggest hanging of the summer. Remember that we um tag I used for one of my paper views about like 28 years ago. But uh, game and Jesus, then you know. But anyway, guys, check out all the other fids on the channel, like us ranking quite a few paper views for 2001. All the matches from the paper views in order, worst the best. Um, but anyway, we'll see if we can talk to anyone backstage, corridor, you can talk with Stephanie McMahon. Big Papa Pump, what do you want? I'm sorry, excuse me. Hello. Oh hey, how's your room? Well... Everything's fine. Looks like that's a transfer happening to uh, SmackDown. What? You're still here? I didn't ask for you to come by. Can you do me a favor and shut the door on your way? She forgot about you. Minus one. See, well, there is actually no point of doing these bikes. It just loses you fucking superstar points. Like, like I'm not even joking. But hold on here. Yeah. Endurance. Boom, there we go. Adding, uh, changing some of our stats there. I've actually, I mean, I've actually saved them up. I haven't even went into this. That stuff, um, yep, yeah, profile. Alright, start the event. Will we be on the card? I don't think we will be unless we've been put into a match. Um, no, but as you can see, it's a basically a full. Well, not, is it? It's a full. <laughs> The full SmackDown show, we've got Ray defending against Matt Hardy, Benjamin and Charlie Haas in a four-man cruiserweight match, so we'll skip that. And Matt Hardy is your new cruiserweight champion. Now we have Eddie Guerrero versus John Cena in a steel cage match. Guerrero retains the US Championship, and in our main event we will watch this Undertaker against Kurt Angle, Hell in a Cell. Seems a wee bit <laughs> excessive to have... Um, a steel cage and a Hell in a Cell match in the same show. That's just uh, my opinion of the matter, guys. But here we go. Kurt, we don't even get entrances, man. It's just Kurt Angle taking on the dead man inside Hell in a Cell with Tim White as the referee. So this should be a decent match here. For the WWE Championship, watching a SmackDown what match on a on, on the Raw brand. What's going on? Angle the way a massive suplex he is on. The ref's no up, man. One. Get a one count, but that's about it. For the big man. That's what you get. Undertaker now. Oh, big Kurt though. Big elbow. Big evil. Just count our city, man. I would not want to be taking on any of these two because they're just absolutely. And I let you. Know, Undertaker has clearly proven that here. Right hooks the angle and Taker slams him into the deck. Fuck me, looks. Why has he spun Undertaker that many times? He's got Taz mission. Chicken wing. Whatever you want to call it, man. Nearly beat. Can you actually leave the ring in the Hell in a Cell in this game? I can't remember, I don't think I've ever been in a Hell in a Cell, I mean maybe I was like 15 years ago, like I mean, it's hard to remember stuff when you were like 5 guys, but Undertaker with a suplex to cut angle, off the top rope, and now these two are trading blows, back in, 
back and forward and now cut angle. Can you get a bit of momentum? No. Undertaker's like, you're not getting any momentum, mate. You're pumped, big man. Right hook. And a drop kick there for Kurt. Angle. But yeah, Undertaker's the guy who, who's nearly got his, um, I'm saying nearly, I mean, he's a lot closer than him. One cart defeat big evil. Big evil undertaker. One cart suplex undertaker night, but a yellow body, not good. Not good for the big man. Taker throw an angle into the corner. Going for Snake Eyes, no that's Snake Eyes, what do you call it? What do you call that move? Snake Eyes when he drops him into the corner, I can't think what he calls that move. I feel like I've just jobbed this all out by not being able to remember it. Come on guys, I fucking jobbed this out, suplex there by Kurt. Another in. Oh he's going for the three amigos. Even though, literally him and Ben Ward did it, man. Well, Ben Wall probably did it before Guerrero being real. I'd say so, but now it's a belly to belly. Angle but gaining some momentum. He's a lot closer to the finisher, big man. What's the goal with Dan Tom? 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 Right, come on, Angle. Fucking hell, Undertaker's right hook, man. Send you to the moon and back. God damn it, son of a bitch, he is battering him. Cart. Undertaker rolls out the way. Both got the same amount of damage. They're both of them Kurt's winging Taker halfway across the room though. God damn it. Jesus Christ, what's going on there? And now, Kurt Angle is going for the ankle lock. On the dead man. We're going to get a submission, a submit. Nope. Come on, tap. Nope, he's no tapping the day. One. Two. Undertaker kicking, more or less a two count there. Down, 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 down. Big knee to the midsection, no for Kurt. Obviously you get your finisher going up more the second time around. Taker's got an orange body. Look at his legs, man, he locked in the ankle lock, he should be hammered. Neck break though by the dead man. Come on, pick him up. What the hell's going on? Angle slam. Nope. Dun 
Dun -dun 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 -dun. Kurt with a right hook. Undertaker counter it. Undertaker mate, you need to get your finisher going if you stand a chance here. And now Kurt with more momentum. Big suplex into a pinning combination. One, two. Tell you what, Earl, if you were quicker at the end of the count, I think it's, yeah, it's Earl, it's no Tim White, I don't know why I called him Tim White earlier. I mean, he could have had him beat there. We talk about having him beat. Undertaker, no far away if you have him as finisher. And that could literally be it. Come on. Bit of action. Put to the midsection, Undertaker, right hook again. Another right hook. Another right hook, man. Big elbow. How the hell's he not got his finisher yet? But he's feeling the effects of those Germans, man. And now Kurt Angle. Looking for a manoeuvre. Another suplex. Damn right it is. I mean, he could, he, Kurt Angle could be getting a finisher here before. Another one before. T oh, well, this could be it for under. Oh, he's countered it. Angle's the countering fucking machine at this stage. Absolutely, yeah. Shocking. One. Two. I kind of looked like he let him up instead of fucking. Um. The, the other way a bit like, which is a bit. A bit retarded like, but. Angle now. Looking to get the job done. And now, the dead man. I mean, how has he not got a finisher yet? This is absolutely fucking shocking. Shocker, Rooney, man. Big elbow from the big man. Undertaker with a red body. He, he, he can't even get any momentum because he just fucking shrivels back into the, a shell of his former self. Come on, Kurt. Pack him up. Big boot, though. Now, Undertaker. Picking up Kurt Angle, big knee to the ground. I mean, is Taker's bar even going up? Ah, it is like, but it's going up so fucking slow. Boston Crab. Right, he's near got it. One more, one more maneuver. He'll have it. There we go. But Angle's countered it. I don't think Undertaker's mouth was bleeding there. Big knee though, and it's Undertaker, the American badass, going for the last ride. Will that be it? Bet your bottom dollar that probably is it. That's it. One. Two. Undertaker got battered the whole match, guys, but he manages here to pick up the win. I mean, my money would have been on Kurt Angle, like, but. Nope. Not today, not tomorrow. And there we go. The American badass has won. And all we did was lose a superstar point. <sighs> Not bloody good. Oh, here's good old JR. Do you have a minute? I want to discuss something with you. So what's on your mind? Form a faction? A faction, huh? That could be very interesting. I'll let Mr. McNair know about your plans. JR's looking forward to it. We need something, man. Bloody. Damn right, we need something. Save that in the memory card. But hopefully, we can create a faction and take over Raw. Like Evolution or something, because we've just been getting jobbed out left, right, and centre. At the, um. At the minute here, but. Anyway, that will do it for this episode of Scott Steiner SummerSlam. Decent enough card, even if it was all smacked in, but until next time.